Hello friends, so welcome to another video from Shomu's Biology and we are talking about mnemonics and in this video we will be talking about vitamins, classification and deficiency in mnemonics and shortcuts. Uh, we know that many of you have trouble remembering all the vitamins and also their classification especially vitamin B all their names and their respective deficiencies this video is just for you so stay tuned and watch the complete video like every single video of mnemonics in this video also we are going to tell you some weird stuff that will definitely help you to remember so first of all we'll be talking about the classifications uh, and you need to remember Ronaldo playing football for a particular club that's how easy it is and you also need to remember one thing that's Kodak spelled wrong that is Kodak and we'll be talking about that in a moment and a cracked floor although very weird to connect all these three things but yes you can remember if you connect these three things together so let's look at the first part that is vitamin B classification but before vitamin B classification let me tell you the general classification of the vitamins and that gives you fat soluble vitamins that is vitamin A D E and K and then water soluble that is vitamin B and C we are not more, not much bothered about vitamin A, D, E and K because they are not they don't have subclasses where vitamin B has. So vitamin B classification goes something like this. The Ronaldo and Paolo played for Biochester Football Club. Although Biochester is a fictional club that I've created, but although it, it, it's really important to help you remember. So the Ronaldo and Paolo played for Biochester Football Club. And you can see the red highlighted regions are those exact uh, name of the subclasses of the vitamin B. So let's look at here vitamin B1 is thiamine and that is what given with TH. So this is the first one. Then R stands for riboflavin vitamin B2. Then N stands for niacin vitamin B3. Then PA stands for pantothenic acid vitamin B5. Then another P stands for pyridoxine vitamin B6. Then another BIO, BIO stands for vitamin B7 or biotin. Then FO stands for folic acid, vitamin B9. And last, vitamin B12 stands for C, that is cobalamin. So you go with thiamine, riboflavin, niacin, pantothenic acid, pyridoxine, biotin, folic acid, cobalamin. So remember bio stands for biotin, vitamin B7 and afterwards we only have 2, vitamin B9 and 12. Before that we have 6, 5, then 3, 2 and 1. This is how easy it is to remember all the name of the vitamin B with their respective uh, chemical names. Okay. So now let's look at the vitamin deficiencies. So there are different diseases associated with vitamin deficiencies. Deficiency for vitamin A, D, E, K as well as B, C. So let's first look at deficiency of other vitamins except for vitamin B. So to remember that we need to know KDAC. Remember I, I said we need to alter this Kodak a little bit KDAC but that will work because first remember this kdak and second remember one sentence that is he seats uh, he steals the rickshaw at night dark sky okay he steals the rickshaw at night dark sky so in this case what we should do is first of all this kdak i hope you know that vitamin k e d a and c we are talking about except for b and now we'll connect everything together so first of all with k is with hemorrhage and hemorrhage stands with this h e hemorrhage then E is vitamin E with the ST or sterility that is linked with steel, sterility. Got it? STE, the first three alphabets there. Then we'll be seeing vitamin D. Vitamin D with Rickson, RI, this is for ricket. Okay. Then we have vitamin A and vitamin A with night blindness. So that's why you have the term night sky so night blindness and last but not the least vitamin c with sky and scar v is the deficiency disease all the homophonic sky scar v that's why i put it here so he steals the rickshaw at night dark sky hemorrhage sterility ricket night blindness and scar v are the respective deficiencies now let's look at the deficiencies linked with b vitamin so this will be a little difficult because there are a lot of names. So let's look at the, the, the this term first. Berry cracks the floor playing with Papan. That will be the sentence. Berry and Papan playing together, cracking the floor. That's why I said you need to remember some cracked floor. And as you say that uh, you can see here the underlined regions are the actual 
deficiency diseases that are associated with vitamin B. So the first one, vitamin B1 deficiency cause beri beri. Vitamin B12 cause cracks in the lips and you know mouth and uh, tongues. Vitamin B3 play pellegra play and pellegra vitamin B3. Then vitamin B5 with uh, PA starts with PA so pasthesia. Acne is also part of it. Then vitamin B6 causes AN starts with AN so anemia. Vitamin B9 also causes anemia. But the difference between B6 and B9 anemia is that B6 anemia is microcytic anemia and B9 is macrocytic anemia. So that's how easy it is to remember vitamin B deficiencies. Remember we start with 1, 2, 3, then 5, 6 and 9 because you don't write all the vitamins from 1 to 9. We have 1, 2, 3 in sequence, then 5, 6 in sequence and then ultimately a 9 at the end. So if you remember all these sentences and these pictures and if you probably read this video a couple of times, this will be printed in your brain. You can modify uh, if you want uh, some part of the mnemonics you can modify on your own to suit your understanding better. But always look at this channel to get more and more such kind of mnemonics that will definitely help you. So stay tuned and watch other videos in my channel. Share this video with your friends. Thank you very much for watching.